I'm about to start my workout and we have the ladies here for boot camp this morning. Zach is teaching this morning. Got my BCAAs, my thing is kind of rubbed off. <laughs> but this is kind of what boot camp consists of. It's a little bit of everything. Say hi, Zach. <laughs> <laughs> so Zach is putting the ladies to do some cardio, some agility stuff. They use their use the Muay Thai, the MMA timer. <laughs> so you hear his beep. So we work on a lot of like um, body weight stuff and weights. So you get a little bit of everything. Cool thing about the the boot camps is they're always different. So you are gonna never get bored. <laughs> You're never gonna plateau. Some of the ladies have been coming for years and they still get sore every single week. Our focus, our passion, our goal is that you guys will always succeed. So when you take classes, you're coming in and you're gonna always be progressing forward. You're never it's gonna be at a standstill. You're never gonna plateau. And because um, I know personally with me and Zach with our own selves, <laughs> we always wanna be progressing forward. So we wanna help others succeed in that too. The camps run five days a week. So I teach three days, Zach teaches two days, and we have another employee that teaches two evening classes. If you go on to our website, lifeofhomefitness.com, you can see all the info there. So anybody in the local area, you drop in, we have passes, we have really good membership uh, packages. Otherwise, people from far, you're more than welcome to just fly in, swing by, or passing through, come see us, come check out the gym, grab a workout. You know, we're always here if I'm not traveling. So, <laughs> so we also offer Muay Thai, so you can see the bags back here. Um, so we do Muay Thai, MMA training, we do, do kickboxing and cardio kickboxing. We also have Brazilian Jiu Jitsu here. We have an adults class and we also have a kids class. They're are probably the most popular thing in our gym is all of our classes. So Zach, Zach teaches the MMA, Muay Thai, um, and we also do uh, people who want to take it to that next level and compete. We also do um, train people for that as well. If you want to actually go into a Muay Thai fight or MMA fight or you want to Jiu Jitsu competition, so you have all those options too. Otherwise, you just take it for a workout. <laughs> so now the ladies get to learn using um, bats. So everybody can get to use the actual bats. So you're learning all kinds of stuff in the boot camp, which is cool. So yet another honey buns workout we're gonna do is gonna be full body. So we're gonna focus a lot on legs today. But we'll throw up a little bit of core and arms in there. But stuff like this actually helps to build stability, core strength, uh, back strength, a balance, coordination, at the same time that you can use a lot of free weights. So you won't have to be stuck on a machine. You can really do it anywhere home, gym, you know, whatever's available to you if you have the right equipment. So, first thing we're gonna get is we just need dumbbells today. So, grab a pair of dumbbells, two different sizes if you need it, just in case you need to drop weight. Otherwise, just stick with one if you can handle the one the whole time. <laughs> All right, guys, so I grabbed two different sets of dumbbells. So, I grabbed 12 pounds and I grabbed 15 pounds because I don't know if I'll need to be able to need to adjust in weight and all. Um, so that's why I'm gonna have the two options. Otherwise, I'll just stick with one the whole time. But then I'll kind of, I'll be able to play with it and I'll have to run and get them and come back. <laughs> observed my form of when I was going down I really pushed back into that and sat into that leg and almost lifted my other leg up onto my heel because the, the straight leg the not the non-working leg is more to help 
guide you, to more help stabilize you and balance you versus um, taking all the, taking the work, doing the work. So you wanna focus on the leg that's actually you're sitting into. So that's the key to remember with the, the side lunge. And just, and if you can't go back as far as I did or as low, that's okay. You're only doing it like this, that is okay. So it's always form versus weight or depth. So get your form first, and then you, then you start advancing and progressing. Those hazy days I do remember, we were running still. Had the whole world at our feet, watching the seasons change. Now, if you can't squat pause with the weight like that, there is an alternative for beginners. You're gonna do a wall sit with the weight. So if you're just have a weak core, have a weak, weaker back, and can't you know get that depth, or people who have any back injuries, things like that, you can use the wall as a guide to help stabilize you, to make sure you have the correct form, to be able to execute the exercise without overdoing it on yourself for the first time. So you can start with the wall and work your way up to doing no wall. So any of you that struggle with your know, proper form, having a straight back, not letting your knees go over your toes, just in general with any squatting exercise, you can certainly use a wall for really anything until you really build up that proper form but that'll help train your mind and your body by using a wall like that to have correct form when you are off the wall. So that's a great little tip, especially for beginners, <laughs> when doing any squat variation. <laughs> dumbbells at your shoulders you can hold them at your side or you can drop weight even more if um, the current weight you started with is too much I would say really try to focus on doing it at your shoulders because just the targets different muscles it creates a different intensity it creates a different challenge so try to challenge yourself in that way but You want to make sure too you're going flat footed with that exercise. You want to try to come as flat as you can on your foot. No tippy toes. Here we stand up in arms. This is home where we are ever strong in the world that we made. I still hear you in the breeze. See your shadows in the trees. Holding on memories never change.
Lower abs. 